on YouTube here, so I'm not quite sure who it is, but <coughs> anyway, so hello, hi, I've been MIA for a while, um, I've been sick, sorry, um, I've been sick and it's kind of been like really gloomy around here to try and get lighting fixed, um, I'm trying to upload a tutorial right now, but it's not really going too hot because my internet sucks because the wind is crappy and it's taking out lines or something. So anyway. But this time they had um, uh, Urban Decay Stardust eyeshadows in retrograde and um, Space Cowboy and it's just a sample and that might totally like hit you guys in the face, but I'm sorry if it does. Um, the next thing I got is um, an Urban Decay... An Urban Decay Single Shadow in um, Chronic, and I highly doubt that you're going to be able to focus in on that, so I'm just going to show you what it looks like. And it looks like that. Oh, this is wicked pretty green color. Here. Can that you is see the that? Urban Decay Urban Defense Tinted Moisturizer SPF 20 in Halo. It just looks like this. You take it off, it's a wicked cool. It has the pump. Do, do, do. And um, I use this every now I've and then. I've used it. Next is um, a Urban Decay palette in Roller Girl. I'm pretty sure. Right? Roller Girl? Hold on. I'm like, it doesn't like say on it, but this is Roller Girl. It, had, it came with a Urban Decay Lip Junkie lip gloss in Cools and Pumped. Looks like that. And it's like this really pretty pink color. And it's actually really, really uh, pigmented. And I didn't know that the first time I put it on, so I kind of like um, locked it on. I'm just gonna hold this back. The palette, I gotta hold the, the palette on the inside looks like this. And it comes with an Urban Decay 24-7 Glide-On Pencil in Whiskey, I think it is. Yep, in Whiskey. It's a brown. And I, I love these. Both of, ooh! And it comes with four it. colors. So you have Woodstock right here. It's a really pretty pink. I think Verge is what that says. Yep. And then, and then Suspect and Dark House. Yeah. Or Dark Horse, not Dark House. That's stupid. Yeah. So those are the colors, and they're all wicked pretty. And I've used them all, and I love them. I gotta get used to like high end makeup because I don't know. It just looks different. I don't know. The next palette I got was the Urban Decay Vegan Palette, and it is the coolest looking palette I've ever seen. That's what the front looks like, and then the back just blah, blah, blah. And on the front it says, we don't do animal testing, how could anyone? And then, without, I'm going to try not to blind you, this is what the inside looks like. Again, you have another Urban Decay 24-7 Glide-On Eye Eye liner and this one's in zero which is black and then you have these gorgeous colors um on the top is minx herb and gunmetal and on the bottom is twice baked smog and half baked so that's what they look like they're all wicked pretty and it also came with a um miniature urban k Eyeshadow primer potion. So, and I yeah. think this one's so just like that. I'm listening to some awesome music. And then the last thing I got was an um, a nail polish set, and I'm so excited about it. And it's the Roller Girl one. And so this is what it looks like. These are all the colors. I'll start over here. And they're all so pigmented, like mad crazy. I used this one, which is in Fame. So yeah, so I pretty. will hopefully see you guys soon. I'm waiting for my um, first ever purchase from Forever 21 to get here in the mail. Hopefully it will get here tomorrow. I paid $16 for freaking shipping, so it better get its ass here. 
um, I bought myself a pair of Oxfords ugh, and then um, a couple shirts so um, oh and if you guys don't know right now on the website and I think in store for Forever 21 it's buy one get one free go and get you some awesome all right I love you guys bye